Welcome to the Bookshare Exploratory Workshop. Here you will learn how students with reading barriers can access over 1 million free books with Bookshare. My name is Laura Ronberg, and today we will cover what Bookshare is and who is eligible, how to set up your account, how to assign books to students and get them reading, and strategies to ensure success with Bookshare in the classroom. A few Bookshare facts. Bookshare is run by Benetech a nonprofit technology company. Benetech believes that equitable access to education is a human right. Our technology and services break down systemic barriers and empower all learners regardless of ability. With Bookshare, we serve over 900,000 students in all 50 states. Over 40,000 schools and districts have Bookshare organizational memberships, and over 20 million books have been downloaded over the past decade. Approximately 10% of students have barriers to reading and comprehending printed materials. To fully participate in the classroom, they need access to the same materials at the same time as their peers in the formats that work for them. This is where Bookshare comes in. Bookshare is an ebook library with over 1 million titles and formats that work for students who need accessible materials. For some students, that means books and audio highlighted text with synchronized audio, braille or larger print. Best of all, Bookshare is free for qualified U.S. students thanks to our funding from the U.S. Department of Education Office of Special Education Programs. The Bookshare collection includes textbooks, fiction, nonfiction, award winners and bestsellers, career and technical materials, and so much more. Books are available for students of all ages, from pre-K through 12th grade, post-secondary and vocational education programs. Bookshare is also a great resource for reading for pleasure. We have over 40,000 books in Spanish and books in over 60 other languages. Bookshare books are available 24 seven with no limitations on the amount of time students have access to the books. Unlike other digital libraries, there is no need to check out a book place a hold, or return the book. Bookshare helps students with reading barriers access the grade level content they need to be successful in school and become a reader for life. There are many ways to read Bookshare books, computers and Chromebooks, smartphones and tablets, braille devices, smart speakers, and specialized assistive technology devices. Bookshare has our own suite of reading tools called the Bookshare Reader. It is available for computers and Chromebooks, mobile devices, the Alexa and the Alexa smart speaker. They offer many ways to customize the audio, font type and size, and the color and contrast. Students must have a qualifying disability to use Bookshare, and they generally fall under three categories, visual impairment, learning or reading disability, or physical disability. If a student's disability affects their ability to read and comprehend traditional printed materials, they may qualify for Bookshare. One way to think of this is Bookshare is for students who can't hold a book in their hands and turn the pages. They can't see the words on the page, or they can't decode or comprehend the words on the page. To qualify for Bookshare, a professional with appropriate expertise must certify that an individual meets at least one of those qualifications. Examples of qualifying professionals at the school level include, but not limited to, special education staff, assistive technology team members, occupational or physical therapists, reading specialists, or teachers. These professionals have either evaluated the student or have reviewed evaluations, IEPs, or other school documentation and make the decision that the student qualifies for Bookshare. Bookshare offers two account types. Educators sign up for what we call an organizational account. These accounts can be created at a school or district level. On the district level, these accounts are often managed by the assistive technology, visual impairment, or special education department. On organizational accounts, educators simply add their qualified students to the account roster. Note that Bookshare calls educators sponsors and refers to students as members on these accounts. Accounts can have as many sponsors and members as desired. Sponsors find and assign books to the students. 
Students then log in on the device of their choice and read the book. They can only read books that have been assigned to them by their educators. Bookshare also offers individual memberships for both students and non-students. Students can have both types of accounts, and both types are always free. Individual memberships allow students to independently search the full Bookshare collection and read what they want when they want it. For students who are struggling with reading, being able to read what they want for pleasure, in addition to their coursework, can help them improve their reading skills and encourage a lifelong love of reading. Now that we have covered the basics, I'm going to take you over to the Bookshare website and show you the educator experience, the student experience, and where to find the help and support resources that can help you get up and running with Bookshare in no time. First, I will log in as a sponsor and I will be taken to the My Bookshare page. The My Bookshare page is your dashboard where you add students and other sponsors. To start, I will add a new student to my account. Select the Members link and then select the Add Member button and fill in the required information. Be sure to set a username and password as this is how students log in and find their assigned books. Next, selecting the type of disability serves as proof of disability. Nothing more is needed. Also be sure to note if the student has an IEP or 504. While these are not necessary for students to access Bookshare, we do collect this information for reporting purposes. Also, students who have IEPs have access to materials from the National Instructional Materials Access Center, often referred to as the NIMAC. The NIMAC contains textbooks and other books that are only available to students with IEPs. When you are finished, select Save. You will have the option of assigning books or adding the student to a reading list. For now, I will select Not Now so I can show you the different ways to find Bookshare books. There are three ways to find Bookshare books. The easiest way is to search in the search bar that is found at the top of the page on the Bookshare website. You can search by title, author, or ISBN. For a more narrow search, select the Advanced Search link. Here you have the option to enter information in a variety of fields. You can also filter by category. If you're not sure what book you want your students to read, select the Browse link. The Browse page contains special collections curated by the Bookshare Collection Development Team. As I mentioned earlier, Students can only read books that have been assigned to them. There are two ways to assign books, one at a time using the Assign button or by adding several books to a reading list that you create and assign students to. When you find the book you want, simply select the Assign button and then select the student or students you wish to assign that book to. Select the Assign button and students have immediate access to that book. Reading lists are an effective way to assign several books at once. The list can be created by grade, class, student, topic, or any way you like. To create a reading list, select the My Reading List link and then the Create button. Give your list a name and select the sharing permissions. You can either share the list with a student or students you wish to have access to that list, or you can share it with the organization. This means that other sponsors on the account can access that list and use it with their students. Select Save when finished. Next, you will add the members you wish to access the books on this list. Select the Add Members button and select the students or student from your roster you wish to read the books. Select Add Selected Members. Next, select the Titles link. Then select the Add Books link and search for titles. Repeat this process until you have added all the books you wish to add. When you're finished, select Save and Close. 
Students on that list now have access to all of those books. Now I will show you how students log in and find their assigned books. Students log in with the username and password that was created for them when they were added to the account. When they log in, they can see their assigned books, which were those assigned using the Assign button, and the reading list to which they have been added to. Students can read their book quickly, easily in the Bookshare Reader for Web by selecting the Read Now button. This opens the book in the browser without having to download any book files. The reader provides highlighted text with synchronized audio and provides many options for customization. Students can customize the audio by selecting the voice and audio speed. They can select the text size and they can select the font. They can select the character spacing. They can choose whether or not to have a paginated or scrolling display. They can adjust the margins and the line spacing. They can also select the color scheme. Some students will prefer a light background with dark text, while others may prefer a dark background with light text. There are many other options in between. Students can also select the color for the sentence line highlight, as well as the word level highlight. When they have established their settings, they can go to the table of contents and begin to read where they wish. They can either select the play button or double click anywhere on the page to begin reading. Who's there? He shouted. I warn you, I'm armed. There was a pause. Then, smash. The door was hit with such force that it swung. Students also have the option of downloading the book in a variety of file formats. They can download the book as an audio file, BRF, EPUB, or Word. Students can also read Bookshare books on the Bookshare Reader for Mobile. It is our free app for iOS and Android devices. They log into their Bookshare account through the app and select the book they wish to read. They select the Read Now button and have options to customize the audio, text, page, and color. They can select the chapter they wish to read and select the Play button. Chapter 3, The Letters from No One the escape of the Brazilian boa constrictor earned Harry his longest ever punishment. By the time... There are other free and low-cost apps for mobile devices and specialized assistive technology devices. The Reading Tool Wizard, located in our Help Center, can help you and your students find the best tool for the devices they have access to at school and at home. For an example, if they have access to an iPad at home, Select the iOS, and here we list recommendations for apps that work best with that device. For students who use assistive technology devices such as Braille note takers, they would select the Braille note taker, and here we have information for a variety of the common popular devices in that category. We have a robust online learning center found under the Help Center. It contains many helpful resources, including the ABCs of Bookshare for Educators. The ABCs pages have great resources to help you get started with Bookshare easily. Here you will find information, short video tutorials, and how-to guides on all of Bookshare's features, including many that we didn't have time to cover today, but are useful as you implement Bookshare. We also have a help center where you can search for information, find answers to frequently asked questions, as well as the contact information from our customer support team who are available by phone and email. Bookshare contains over 1 million titles, but you might find that there's a book you need that we don't have. You can request it by going to our help center and selecting the I can't find a book, can I request it link. This will take you to a page that has the book request form. Be sure to indicate the book is required for school and enter in as much information as possible. The ISBN is particularly helpful. When you have finished, select the Next button and the request will be submitted to our customer support team. 
Implementing any new technology in the classroom can be challenging, but through the over 20 years of supporting Bookshare in schools, we have found what policies and procedures at the district or school level can help make implementing Bookshare more successful. These include designating one or more persons to be the Bookshare point person who can help train educators and ensure the accounts are updated each year. Coordination with the IT team who can ensure Bookshare is accessible across devices and load any apps on devices if necessary. Determine ahead of time what books will be used throughout the year and assign them to students. Adding individual memberships to student accounts to promote reading independence. Show students how they can customize their reading experience. Find genres that are highly engaging to help students see that reading can be a fun and rewarding activity. Look for textbooks and state or district curriculum titles in the Bookshare collection. If we don't have a title that you need, you can request it. Please do so with plenty of time so we can be sure to have it in time for when your students need it. I will leave you with some resources from Bookshare and OSEP. I hope today's session has been informative and that you are excited to start using Bookshare with your qualified students today.